cherry orchard right now. I just landed here because it's raining and I got to dry the 17 acres again and we figured why should I do it when it's still raining. You can hear a helicopter off to my west, probably one of the Ueys. And I thought I'd take you into the orchard a little bit to show you what the cherries look like when they're wet. So let's go in a few rows here. Man, this grass is really long. Okay, so let's find a good one that's easy to get at. All right, well, here's some cherries here. They actually don't look so bad. See, what they're trying to prevent is from water gathering in the stem cup. That's that top part there. They're wet right now, but I don't see any water pooling up in there. Let's check some more. So here's some more right here. And I don't really, no, I guess it doesn't take much. Here's some really easy to get at ones. Yeah, you see like this one right here. That one, you see the water in there? And the one behind it? This is what we're trying to prevent. So when I fly by, I shake the branches like this, and that shakes the water off. But I'm doing it at the top. So all the water from the top is coming down, and although I am getting the ones near the bottom a little bit, I'm not getting them nearly as much as uh, the ones on the top. So what it's taking on this particular orchard is two passes. The fruit's really heavy at the bottom. So they're not gonna pick this fruit for another, uh, let's see now, uh, 10 days. 10 days from today is when they're going to supposedly pick, unless they pick sooner. And that's what it's all about. Here's one with water dripping from underneath. You see that droplet? Whoops. That's some wet cherries. So, that's what I'm here for. Look at the way they grow. These huge clumps. Oop, and here comes the rain. I'll be back in the helicopter. Hope you enjoyed that. <laughs> that's it. You hear that Yui? Man, it sounds like he's really close. I wonder if he's getting rained on too. Alright, I'm turning this off because I'm going to run for it.